Alright guys, it's me, 25 welcome to Spyro, A Hero's Tale. Yes, this is um, a PlayStation 2 game in the Spyro franchise by um, Assyria. It's also published by Eurocom, same people who did Crash Bash. And I consider it one of the only good PlayStation 2 Spyro games. A lot of people didn't like this game, but honestly, after you've played like the Legend of Spyro, you begin to appreciate this game. At least it even tried something to start a new game. As you can see, I've already got save files on here. 38%. I didn't actually get this far into. The, I, I didn't actually get in. I didn't actually get far into this game originally. Uh, things. I think it, the thing it became too difficult. <laughs> I don't know. It's actually a pretty difficult game. It's quite. It's got a unique. Not really a unique mechanic, but basically. No, actually, I'll shut up. It's the story. That's the fallen dragon, Red. I'm sorry you thought all about him. No. I thought he was long gone. But it looks like he's been mining dark gems and planting them all over the realms. He's even got Nasty Nork and his minions doing all his dirty work. Nasty Nork? Didn't I defeat that guy years ago? Huh. What are dark gems? Oh, questions, questions. So many questions. Answer them twat. Dark gems are the life draining stones that fuel Red's evil power. If you're going to stop Red, you'll have to find out more about him and destroy all the dark gems. But first, go and see Moneybags. He usually has something worth buying. <laughs> Thanks, Spyro. Uh, now I'll unlock that door so you can. Oh, Spyro. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, welcome to Spyro. A Hero's Tale. It's definitely one of the most strangest Spyro games, but at least it plays like the original, and that's what and that's what goes for it. You know, that's what that's what makes this game decent. It actually plays like the original games, unlike the other ones where it's you know I want to do some different Spyro, which doesn't work at all. Yeah, this one is cool. Yeah, you can flame, you can charge, and it looks pretty decent. This game came out in 2004. So for a 2004 game, it looks pretty decent. Looks a lot better than uh, Enter the Dragonfly, which is quite funny. I can't actually glide though, what the hell? Why can't I glide? I haven't learned, learned that yet. Right, so there's, there's the professor's lab. Alright, so gems are a bit different in this game. Um, you do not collect all of them in a level to get something. There are infinite amount of gems. It's like currency, and you'll will pick them up. But at least they're worth the same. I should know they're not. Ah, oh, Spiral! <laughs> How nice to see you. I was hoping to remodel my third home, and no one over there is like you. <laughs> oh, but don't bother coming back here until you've got 500 gems. Okay? Okay. So I have to buy my way to a shop. Money bags are twat and I hate them. Alright, so these are dark gems. And you can destroy them. And they give you gems. And they're also the main thing in this game. So basically, if you didn't hear the professor, an evil dragon called Red has taken over and he's employed a uh, nasty nort from the first game. Uh, I don't know why he's still in it. I think he might have died, but whatever. And he's now doing. He's basically putting all these things everywhere. Yeah. 
they basically make the world look horrible when the world's looking you know it looks quite nice and stuff and now he's trying to make it all look ugly i don't know i'm really bad at what money bags these are your fucking gems I am not a fan of new money, but it is money after all. So, go inside and buy a lockpick. Alright, I want to know why. Hang on. Feel free to browse my fine wares, Spyro. And spend, spend, spend. So why the fuck does Moneybags have a fez? <laughs> you can buy Pokeballs, as you can tell. Nothing but the best. So you didn't actually gain access to um, the shop. You actually gained just to, to buy that, which you, which you unlock a door to, I think. Yes, that one over there. Now, don't get me wrong. There's a few things wrong with this game, and it's not the perfect Spyro game in the world. Um, the voice acting is pretty... Well, it's a bit all over the place. Sparrow sounds really rough in this game. Uh, the professor sounds bored. And Moneybag sounds like a foreigner. Uh, I'm not saying that in a racial way, but he, he, he sounds like a purposely like a foreigner. He's got a fez and everything. I don't know why. I don't know what they're going for, really. Um, let's go in here. Small dark holes. Not a problem for me, Spyro. I'll have that lock removed in no time. <laughs> Oh yeah, Spark speaks in this game. Why does Spark speak in, in any game? Oh god. Yeah, the new ones. You listen to Sparks' voice in the new ones, guys, and prepare to kill yourself. Hi, Zo. Hey there, Spyro. When I zap you with my wand like this, your current position and progress is saved. Also, you lose a million brain cells. Wow, a million brain cells? That seems excessively destructive. Uh, that seems kind of bad. Okay, okay, it's cool. Yeah, this game's got a bit of humor in it. It's pretty, it's not bad. It's a pretty childish game. I mean, Spyro has been, but. Oh, yeah. Oh. 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 No. Oh. Ah. Oh. No, no, no. No, no. No, 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 they give Spyro a love interest in this game. Why? I have no fucking clue. He doesn't need one. It's a fucking dragon. Oh. Yeah, you, you have to destroy. What did you say again? I missed it because I walked out the room. Go ahead, Spyro. You should go and see the elder. Why? Right. What's the name of Ember? Ahead, yeah, Ember. I remember it. I'm such a bad person. She's in this game for no fucking reason. And that's part of the reason why many people didn't like this game. <laughs> didn't it say something like an engagement ring? Ugh. Why? Oh, whatever. So that's one of the things wrong with this game is her. She's, she's pointless in every way. Uh, you've also got different abilities you can do. Um, you get bombs, like grenades, <laughs> I don't know why, but they do different things, and you also get different power-ups that aren't in other Spyro games, like a double jump later on. Where the fuck is the Elder? I can't go across there, can I? I can't, I can't even fly yet. Yeah, they, uh, they took the ability to fly out. You have to unlock it. Oh, there you are. Yeah, I know what, I know what weights do. Come on, play video games for a long time now. <laughs> Hi, Elder. Ah, oh, Master Spyro, you must be setting out to stop Red from using the Dark Gems to take over the world. Yeah, something like that. Hey, who's Red? Ah, Red was once an elder like myself. 
I'd tell you the whole story, but I'm old and I take a really long time to tell stories. So, how about I just tell you how to destroy the Dark Gems instead? <coughs> Whew, close one. Yeah, do that. To destroy Dark Gems, <coughs> you use your horn dive. Horn dive. So now I now I can double jump and do a head bash. Horn dive. Fucking horn dive. What the hell? Oh. Uh, when you destroy the big ones like that, it changes the scenery. Now I can actually play. Hey, Hunter, he's back. Spyro, did you know you can use the double jump to glide further? So, double jump and glide already, buddy. If you find a dragon egg and get back here safely, oh. I'll open the door. There's also a dragon egg in this game, I forgot. Uh, I mean, yeah, think what you will of this game, but I think it's decent enough to play. <laughs> But some of the voice acting is a bit shit. Like, it's nothing like the original. That's what gets me. Spyro doesn't sound anywhere near as good as the original. I mean, they got. I mean, they got Hunter right. Uh, Hunter sounds. You know, and he looks like the original as well. And, and honestly, Spyro, the actual model for Spyro, it looks like the original. So. Obviously, they're trying to go for the original, but they just didn't quite get it. Strong chest requires something very powerful to open them. Mm. Like a bomb, maybe. I didn't like. I don't like the gem system in this game. Either. Yeah, the I like how gems you I like how gems in the original were just you collect all of them and you get a prize. In this game the currency and I don't really like that. I mean, I mean in the original game there were currency as well, but it, you could do like you could um, I mean it, it was part of the part of the game you had to collect them to unlock things, but they were still like collect all 300 in a level and, you know complete the level. And in this game it's like infinite gems everywhere. It, it, it doesn't make them as precious. You, you know how I'm about gems. I like precious gems. And dragon eggs. Go to the... Um, oh, I, can't, I can't go. Can I go to the menu? There's several different collectibles in this game. Uh, I can't remember all of them. One of them is dragon eggs. Um, I'm, I, I won't be surprised if some of them are orbs, but I, mm, I don't think orbs are in this game. Yeah. See, it looks pretty good. Fireball. Oh, there we go, look. So you got, um... That's power R2. I can look at my breath, so I can change the breath later on. Uh, oh, no, no, that's the bomb, sorry, my mistake. There's dragon eggs, there's dark gems, and there's also light gems, which I like Professor talks about later on. I don't know. The health mechanics work in the same as the other games as well. Oh, and this works really works the same. So, yeah. I'm gonna play this game for a bit longer because I do actually like it. Again, it's got its problems, but hey. Hey, nice one, Spyro. You managed to find the dragon egg. All right, keep it safe. Somebody might be looking for that. Oh, now allow me to get the door. So.
so impressive. Yeah, you, 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 you get to play as five heroes in this game. That's the whole thing about it, is a hero's tale. There's five heroes to play as. You can play as Hunter, Sergeant Bird, Sparks, and Blink. Blink's this mole that they're just introduced in this game. It's like the monkey in Crash Bash. They did it for no reason. Where the hell is Agent 9 gone? I don't even know. Right, okay. I've got a lockpick, don't I? Oh, I use it on the door. No. Cool. That looks very angry over there. Oh, God. Spyro, this is an activation pad for my latest invention. The bomb gadget. Of course, to operate it, you need to collect eight power stars. Power stars? I've never even heard of Of course. Oh. Uh, how about red coins? My reference? No. Hard Load of fruit. Gold tokens. I'm at a loss, Spyro. What exactly do you need to collect? Uh, I don't know. Light gems? Fine. You need eight light gems. Anyway, huh? off you go. I'll open the to be funny. Okay, this game is actually cringeworthy. <laughs> Once you have the light gems, approach the pad, and the ball gadget will automatically activate. And I remember the ball gadget being really stupid. All right. Oh God! The references to Mario games. Oh, we'll try to be funny. This game's pretty cringeworthy. I'm not gonna lie. It's got it's, 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 it's got its moments, but most of the time it's pretty cringe cringeworthy. All right. What's going on here? It's those thieves again. They've just stolen the last of my dragon eggs. Dragon eggs? Oh, yeah, I found one of those. Maybe I can find all the dragon eggs for you. You know, I'm going to be out saving the world anyway. Well, God, as far as a dick in this game. At my last count, there were 80 of them. Ten eggs to a set. If you can find whole sets, I'm sure you'll be rewarded. Good, uh, good voice acting, lady. Oh look, it's a light gem that I just imagined. Oh. <laughs> Fucking stupid terrain, alright. Where do we go now then? Uh. Well, I just came from here. Oh, 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 now I learn, I learn, I know where to go. I have to go back to Ember. Uh, yeah, uh, again, she's not a very interesting character. She's pretty much like a dumb, like a, a dumb blonde stereotype of a dragon, and it's like somehow it's Sparrow's love interest. Don't take that bridge to the swamp, Spyro. If you do, I might never see you again. And I might never see you again. Okay, I'm going. Bye. Da, 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 da. Fuck you. Okay. Go to the bridge. To the swamp. 